Healthcare is incredibly different than it was in the past. The top three challenges that the healthcare sector is facing today are ageing populations, people living longer and therefore have more opportunity to get chronic diseases. Uh, and the longer they live, the more likely they are to have more than one. And consumerism of healthcare, I think people's expectations of their healthcare has changed. The third thing I would say is workforce. We have workforce challenges across the globe in all shapes and sizes. Poopa started as a funding and insurance company in the UK and we are now in many countries across the globe, both in funding and insurance, but also in healthcare provision. So the UK, Spain, Australia, Chile, Hong Kong, we're in lots of places uh, serving lots of people. We have 43 million customers and we have no shareholders. That means that all of the profits that we earn are reinvested into providing more and better services for our customers across the world. We are walking into a future where the healthcare that you receive is going to be personalised to you. I think that health systems have traditionally been focused on fixing people when they're ill. Uh, that's obviously an important action. Actually, prevention is better than cure. Nowadays, we can treat our patients not just with chemistry, but also with technologies. We have Lua offering to our customers many digital services, for example, vital sign measurement through video imaging. So just doing like a video selfie, we can know your blood pressure without touching you. What we do is trying to detect in an early stage all these silent diseases. We have a new service to take care of your mind. This is an AI solution. It recommends you audiovisual content to deal with these stress situations, insomnia, anxiety, or depression. If the bot detects that you really need to see uh, an specialist, it connects you through a digital consultation to a psychiatrist or a psychologist. And these psychologists at the same time can prescribe you a drug treatment, but also a digital treatment. All these innovations must be inside the Blua app. This will help our customers to find more easier uh, all of these services. I think we can really improve the customer satisfaction. Blua is essentially shorthand for Bupa's digital connectivity throughout the healthcare journey. It will make the experience for a healthcare journey for a customer to be more seamless, more personalized, and also it will ensure that customers engage in their healthcare upstream, meaning that they stay healthier for longer and prevent getting disease in the first place. Blua will make healthcare delivery more efficient and sustainable. So for example, this might mean using our digital technology to make sure that the right intervention is delivered at the right time to the right patient when they need it, thereby reducing unnecessary interventions using our technology to make sure that the healthcare experience is heightened. People are more interested in health and healthcare than ever before as a result of COVID. Interestingly, the healthcare industry has seen a surge in digitization following COVID. So people who have difficulty getting to physical healthcare can access healthcare remotely. We see this not just in situations of geographic challenge, so distance, but also in people that have challenges in movement and, and actually getting to their healthcare. So it makes a huge difference. It's also much more efficient. Bupa is hoping to achieve becoming the most customer-centric healthcare company in the world. We launched a customer listening program across 11 countries, of which we listened to customer feedback over 53,000 times. This actually resulted in over 15,000 suggestions by our employees ourselves about how we can improve the customer experience. To truly create a frictionless experience for our customer journey, Bupa needs to continue to invest, and we will do so, in digital technology but also pay attention to those moments that matter in the customer healthcare journey. We are really embracing the future of healthcare. We're embracing new technology, new ways of delivering care, which really are going to help us reach more people, but more importantly, help more people.